So tell me about Wayne Blake and, and Eternity. Okay, did Aubrey tell you that? No, I haven't talked to her yet. Okay, um, yeah, it's a poem that really deeply affected me, I think, when I was younger, and I think it applies explicitly to this film. Like, originally the title was Winged Life, which is one of the lines from the poem. Yeah, so the idea that if you hang on to something and, and you know, something you love or something that you appreciate, if you hang on to it, it will destroy you, but if you sort of enjoy it in the moment and kiss it as it flies, like the poem says, then you're in the right spot, spot I think. Had you just read it and then like it inspired you to start that, that first scene? No, I read that when I was younger. It's just, it's just a poem that always, like, I, I, it's like the only poem I have memorized, so. Oh, that's yeah. crazy. Yeah. So, so it, but it inspired this? It, it did, it, yeah, to some extent, yeah. What kind of, in the letting things go? I mean, the movie, I mean, it's a zombie movie, but it's not yeah. really a zombie. People who don't like zombie movies are gonna love this movie anyway, just because it's, it's a story about letting go and like reconnecting and, and yeah. that whole thing. Yeah, I think, you know, if you think of it as sort of, obviously a metaphor and sort of taking it literally, then, you know, when people die, it's, it, you're supposed to appreciate it in the moment and not hang on to them, you know, obviously after they've gone and wanting them to come back and then having that wish fulfilled is clearly not the best move. So, right. yeah. We don't have much time, so I just want to go the like the hardest scene to, to either write, that uh -huh. took forever to, to get right, or, or, or during shooting. Um, the hardest scene to shoot was probably the, well, I don't want to, spoiler, I don't know, yeah. Uh, the hardest scene to write. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I, I know what your answer is for shooting, so let's go yeah. with writing. The hardest scene to write would be probably just the, um, God, I, none of it was hard. Like, I'm it not saying just, I'm not okay, saying so, a genius, so but it no, wasn't no, no, like, but, I was so like, just, an, the script flowed. Yeah, the script flowed. How long yeah. did it take? I know it was written like 10 years ago, but. It took like a couple weeks to write it. Is that yeah. typically quick for you? Yeah, I mean, usually it takes a couple of months to write scripts. Yeah, this one just kind of flowed out. It was, it was like, kind of easy to... I'm not saying, like, I'm a genius, but I'm just saying it was definitely not that much of a struggle to write it. Yeah. That's interesting. Yeah. Because I heard Huckabee's was, like, 300 and some odd pages when you 325. wrote it. 325. That's yeah. nuts. Yeah, and it took, like, a year and a half to just cut it down to, like, 117 or whatever it ended up being. Yeah. <laughs> Dane is, is so good in this because he, like... He doesn't come from the same world, like, and yeah. I think you said like he was looking for the truth in the lines, whereas everyone else yeah. was looking for the jokes. Yeah. As a director, what's that like when everyone else is looking for different things? Well, you know, for the most part, most of the actors I, I, are have a comedic background, and obviously Dane doesn't. But I don't think they're always looking for the jokes. I think they're more trying to look to be real and kind of present and in the moment. And it, it Dane sort of buttressed the whole world with his sort of grounded drama, and obviously pathos, but. Um, yeah, no, Dean's a funny guy too. Like he's in, in real life, he just hasn't had a chance to you know explore that. So, yeah, I think it was more just I tried to get as many hybrid actors that were able to kind of vacillate between those two worlds, comedy and drama. And Dane obviously has only had that experience, but he was able to do it as well. But for the most part, he was playing it really straight. I gotta let you go. That's how yeah. these things work. But five quick questions. Yeah. One word answers. Film or digital? Film. Writing or directing? Directing. Lennon or McCartney? Um, I guess Lennon. Hitchcock. I mean, it'd be George Harrison, honestly. Harrison? Okay, yeah. no, that's cool. A lot of yeah. people say that. Hitchcock or Kubrick? Kubrick. In one word, life after Beth. Uh, devastation. That's a good one. Yeah, I like I that. Thanks, yeah. Jeff. Yeah, nice Appreciate it. Yeah. Me too.